welcome back to Beauties of Africa and today we're gonna be doing a very special video and that is an Indere Cultural Center and we're gonna see like many dances maybe if we can so we're gonna be showing you yeah and we're gonna be showing you whatever we can so let's get started in Uganda there are a lot of tribes yeah so and the cultural dances of them are yes. working here like a lot of that's dancing. what is gonna happen here those so we don't know for corona whether there is gonna be but we're still gonna show it. yeah like, in yeah the front guys we have entered in Dere cultural center and uh, there are so many beautiful plants and trees we have entered the reception right now and there are a lot of handmade things here uh, like paintings these things made out of uh, like kind of like balls they look like balls and there's drums and different kind of things like that yeah and there are also paintings statues yeah Hello guys, right now we are in this place and there's so many nice beautiful cultural designs and that map you see right there is made out of bark cloth, yeah the Ugandan map and also guys there are many handicrafts over here, paintings as well as this, like wall decorations are also there, look at that uh, Ugandan colored pot and different things like that and this is a drum and it, I think it's the skin of a cow. Oh guys, I think these paintings are for sale. Yeah, they're definitely for sale. If they're writing like $50 and $20, $15, uh, $30, yeah, and different kind of like that. And it, they, they, I think these paints are made out of like this special natural paint or something. So they're so expensive. And yeah, there is that painting my mom like painted and this uh, we we have a lot of amazing painting so these paintings have prices because they're for selling now see this one is $20 this one is $50 this one is 20 and 20 there are 30 and different uh, dollars because they're so hard yeah so this one here for 15,000 it looks so nice this is for 15, for 15, 15, 15, 15, uh-huh, and then this one, I don't know, uh, wow, that's a big page, then this one, we had that one for 30, this one, look at the size of that drum! So guys, this is the accommodations, and yeah, I can, I could see through inside in those small baby windows. I could see a little bit of the inside, yeah, and also uh, there is also some kind of like black and white painting over there, and it, they're made with stones, guys. Can you believe they're made with stones? And there's like this um, a fence, yeah. So guys, next is again another accommodation and we're gonna see inside because I saw that one and I wanted to see this one too and yeah, I think so it's an accommodation I'm not that sure exactly tree all the green nature and the trees in Uganda are so wonderful I uh, like love this tree it's so pretty right so guys there's something colorful over there near the stairs staircase uh, the, it looks so pretty guys yeah I love this African kind of I love this African Even kind me. of I love paintings. They are so nice and detailed. They are so colorful. And they are so pretty. So guys, this is a mural painting. A little colorful and beautiful. And there's a door over there. Beautiful. You see that? There are some dancings over there.
guys, look at the amazing new guided mural paintings. They are so amazing. Like, look at this. I think they are drinking something with a straw. <laughs> programs happen and this wall is made with stones so guys this is a, a place in a semicircle or something that's what she told me yeah it's so, a semicircle shape and this. there are the places sit here and then you see the function which will happen on that stage I think. yeah and they're making this with small small stones when you see from the far, you feel like it's not stones or something else. But when you go close, you understand it's stones. Yeah, for my first thought, I just painted it with like this kind of paint. Brown and white, the first one. It's not paint, it's tones. Yeah, it looks like a lollipop. So guys, this is all where you can sit and that's where the program happens and I think the main tribe of Uganda is Buganda and the language of Buganda is Luganda. So actually like most of the, you see the tribes uh, who start with B, their language starts with L. So yeah. Tree we have to see right now, mystery. Like what is it here? The bicycles over here. It's a place to stay guys. We're gonna show you one of the houses over here, and it looks like this. This is a house we're talking about. It looks like an old type of house, like you see in the yeah. In Uganda. Yeah, there are parts, different things about monitors and everything. I don't know whether they just made it for like this look, but I think so. I also don't know whether yeah. there are bedrooms. And look at this door they made out. Like, see, is it? So these are the things you get in you and used before. There's a chair over here. And this is the door. Like it it's not like a very good door actually. But it feels like it's a very small house. There's pots. And yeah and guys food. also I don't know whether they're welcome to the next house. <laughs> I'm right here inside another house. And the other house. I don't know. Yeah. And this the is a pot. Oh it's a pot. Look at so guys, this is a um, fruit, you find the tree, and there's some things that they mixed or something, let's see. There is some kind of dust or something, cement or something. Village type of houses, yeah. Like, I don't actually wear this sleep, I'm so confused. Maybe the floor's here? Just on the home? So guys, this house. 
house is like so good you could actually stay in there you could feel the cold this house is so good i feel so good right now so guys on top there uh to make it like a sheltery type they have used some grass and guys, then there are weapons inside there so guys these are weapons there are spears there are bows and arrows over here for protection Guys, this is like where they keep the hens and stuff. That's what I feel. The hens and poultry ba bird. Yeah, the, it's made out of grass too, but completely and just a small hole so the poultry or the hens don't run out. And yeah. So guys, actually first we went in the morning. We didn't know the program timing at all. So we came in the morning, but it was not in the morning. It was from evening 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. Yeah, and we enjoyed the dance, guys. Please wait until you see the dance. It's going to be so nice. So, guys, we went back to the car after the morning. We never knew the timing. And also, we came back in the evening again. Yeah, and uh, I'm so excited to see the dance right now. And this is one of the Burundi member who is going to do some dance. Yeah. So guys, here we are at Indira Center and we're gonna have the dances of Banyangale, Busogo, Buganda, Iteso and many other tribes, ETC. And, and also we're gonna have some buffet. That's what they told us at the end of of Indira Center. It's here. I actually wanna travel in a bus right now. I'm gonna sleep in a bus. <laughs> so guys, the parking is very full. We found it somewhere to park, and there, uh, there's a lot of people who are gonna dance for there, and they're gonna use the drums. And that person is gonna dance. Those people are gonna dance for the Burundi tribe, and we're gonna watch all that, I guess. So guys, when we enter, there are so many nice crafts and everything, and there was a big dog, a German Shepherd. I love dogs. So I really wanted to touch the dog and then I told mom, mom, please shoot that dog. It looks so cute.